Hi, my name is Adam. I'm here with SpotX, and today we're going to take a closer look at SkyTech Fireplace Remote Controls. So here we've got a typical gas fireplace, and we've got a SkyTech remote control hooked up to it. As you can see, when I press the on button, it won't come on. So what can we do to resolve this? I'm going to show you a few troubleshooting steps to get your fireplace working again. Locate the receiver box that pairs with the remote. It should be within your fireplace, usually behind an access door like this. After you've removed your access door, the first thing you should find is your gas valve located here. Then on the TH and THTP terminals should be connected two wires that run to your receiver box located here. Then, to test to make sure your receiver box is working, slide the slider switch to the on position in order to turn on your fireplace manually. If it does not, refer to your fireplace operation manual or call a gas fireplace technician. For both the receiver box and for the remote control, check to make sure that your batteries are fully inserted and touching the contacts. Also check to make sure that there's no corrosion within the battery compartments. And then make sure that you're operating the remote control within 20 to 25 feet of the receiver box. After checking the batteries, the next step would be to perform the learn function in order to resync the remote control with the receiver box. Begin by pressing the learn button located here with either a pen or a pencil, after which you should hear a beeping noise. Immediately after, Press the on or mode button in order to confirm the new signal. Your fireplace should now turn on. So if your fireplace doesn't turn on, another step to take would be to reset the codes in the memory within the receiver box. To do so, press and hold the learn button for 15 seconds. After 15 seconds, you'll release the learn button and you should hear three audible beeps indicating that the memory has successfully been cleared. Now you may repeat the learn function as just described. These steps should solve just about any issue you're having with a standard SkyTech Fireplace remote. However, if you're still having trouble after watching this video, please feel free to give us a call and one of our technicians would be glad to assist you. Thanks.